I'm special, and there's no other robot like me. They say that robots can't love. I don't really know if that's true. I grew up typical American life, I guess you could say. I mean, I was a robot. That was a little shocking for my parents. My days are just like anyone else's, I think. I think people have a lot of preconceived notions when they meet a robot. Like, I'm going to talk like this or whatever. But that's just not uh, how I am. I love music, I love collecting music, I love listening to music. Guess what I love about music is that it can put me in touch with the intensely human side of me. People can fall in love to a song. I just love that feeling and I love searching for music that gives me that feeling. And I guess I was looking for a way to share that with people. at a, a local club here in Asbury Park. I like to match beats. I like to scratch. I like to use turntables. It's sort of sensory overload, but I'm not gonna lie to you, I like the attention. But I know the feeling I get when I'm up in that booth and everybody's dancing, and there ain't nothing robotic about it, baby. I think if you're freaked out by me being a robot, then you need to just check yourself. What does the future hold for me? I don't know, just working on myself, working on my mixing, on my DJing. Generally, I think that the world has a lot to learn about robots. And I think if they took the time, they'd like what they found.